Hey, what's up, guys? So today's going to be a little bit of a different scenery for you guys because, um, well, the thing is, I got a notification. I didn't get a notification, but I just checked my emails and my the tracking number on these Beyblades, um, and they just came in the mail probably like today or yesterday. And by the time I got home, uh, it's, it's gonna be it's gonna be dark. So it was raining and everything. So yeah, it's it's getting cloudy. It's gonna be dark. Um, so by the time I got home, uh, I, I would have had to wait for like the next morning to unbox these and I really didn't want to wait because I have a really huge box here. <laughs> you can hear that. It's all Metal Fight. And then this one, this is Metal Fight as well. This is the Vulcan Harusius video game in Japanese. Um, came all the way, both of these came all the way from Japan. So yeah, I just wanted to unbox these in the car. I'm in my car right now. In the car real quick. And uh... By the time I get home, I'll be able to play with them and sort them out and stuff. So I hope you guys enjoy the video. If you guys like the video, just you know, go ahead and press that like button. And uh, if you want to see more videos like this, just you know, stick around, uh, click that subscribe button, and uh, turn the notification bell on, so you won't miss like any notifications from me. Yeah. So here comes the packaging for the metal fight. I'm not gonna show the bottom because that has my address and stuff like that. So yeah. So yeah, okay packaging I guess, and then this one, a lot better, obviously the writing's in Japanese and stuff I don't understand, uh, this is a pretty cool box though, I might keep this, I like how they tape it all the way around and stuff, really cool, alright, uh, should we start with the big one, or the small one, let's start with the small one first, let's start with the small one first, okay, alright, we're just gonna get right into it. Gonna see. Oh, <laughs> I said I was gonna show the front. Hopefully that didn't come out on camera. All right. So, like I said, this is just the one video game. Um, and I don't know if Vulcan Harusius is still in brand new condition or not. I think it was opened already, so maybe it's not brand new, but might be in good condition and this is around the same price if I bought like a used Vulcan Harusius anyway so I might as well get it from Japan in a better condition a lot of tough here. All right, I got the hydro off so I now I can just focus on unboxing Instead of trying to hide the address. Like I said, I had a lot of stuff coming. And if you guys um, haven't seen my last unboxing video, I unboxed the... What was it? Synchrome... Ultimate Synchrome UX set or something like that. That's my set. Uh, it was the Attack and Balance set. Man, it's a lot of tape. So if you guys haven't seen that, go ahead and check that out. That was the last video. Okay, I'm just gonna rip this open now. Okay, cool. So they bubble wrapped it, that's really nice. I'm actually gonna keep these bubble wraps. So, awesome. Let's see how I can unwrap this part now. Just gonna straight up, rip it up, and it comes, they put it in like this plastic bag, or whatever, now I don't know what the name of this video game is, uh, it's for the PSP, I actually have a PSP, I do have a PSP, but I don't know if I can play it. On there because they might be region locked. So there it goes. Vulcan Harusius. Here's the video game. There you can see it's a little cracked, but it is for the PlayStation Portable. And on the cover there you have Jenga, Galaxy Pegasus, the owner of Vulcan Harusius, Subasa, and um uh oh I forgot his name, uh Masamune. And yeah, that's a pretty cool title screen. Let's take a look at the sides right here. So, 
You see Vulcan Harusius right there. Let's take a look at the back. Nice. And then on the side over here. Oops, sorry about that. On the side, we have like the warnings and stuff. Top, bottom. Alright, now let's get into unboxing. So yeah, this was used. I'm starting to see it pretty clearly now. Comes with this little plastic sheet right here. Let's take a look at Vulcan Harusius. Let's check if it's open or not. So the tape is sealed right here. Oh, it might actually be brand new. That'd be so sick. I would have gotten it for like the same price of... It is new. Yeah, it's sealed. Yep, that's that's really cool. So let's take a look at this real quick. Just to get it out of the way. Really clean. It still has that really smooth texture. So whoever owned this took pretty good care of it. And just either didn't play it. Or... Man, this actually looks pretty sick. I'd, I'd love to play this. Look at all those bays. All the characters. I don't know if this takes place in Metal Fusion or... Oh, no, no, no. This is definitely Metal Masters. Yeah, I'm sorry. Because Masamune is in here. And Galaxy Pegasus is in here. So this is what it looks like on the inside. Really cool. Oh, look. There's like a little... Advert, that's a really cool. Nice. There you have Meteor El Drago, Gravity Perseus, Galaxy Pegasus, and Ray Unicorno. Cool. So let's go ahead and put this back in. Enough of that. Okay, so let's go ahead and unbox this. This is brand new. So I'm going to unbox it from the right side. Let's check it out. It says the face bolt. There we go. And what does it even come with again? I forgot. But let's find out together. I just totally forgot. Oh, look at these stickers. That is so cool. They're they're holographic. I didn't know that. That's so cool. Wow. That's really nice. Okay. And I think that's 145 defense. Nice, that's super cool. Super, super cool. I'm definitely going to put those on later. Okay. But I definitely do have to open this up right now, actually. And, uh, actually, you know what? Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm definitely going to have to knife this open. But I'm not going to open the toolkit part up. That's where the stickers is. I'm probably going to... Put the stickers on at home but in the other box there should be an, another like uh assembly tool in there and i will just use one of those instead of opening that up right now but let's go ahead and take a look at vulcan harusius it's a car passing by i'm sorry for all the wind guys nice this is a fresh Vulcan Harusius. So sick. Look at that. Let's take a look at the face bolt real quick. See if we can find the code up in here. Yeah, you guys can probably see the code. Look at the Horusius clear wheel. Nice. And then this, of course, looks like a lot like Beat Links. Okay. So let's go ahead and put it together. Nothing here is too special, just, you know, the classic 145 and then defense. Just some kids passing by. 
around the time where they get off of school. Okay, let's just put this off to the side. Let's open this really big one up. Oh yeah. I could just leave this like this for now. Yeah, it's not tightened all the way. There he goes. I, I did tighten it all the way. Just not the face bolt, but that's okay. All right. Let's get this one. After this, I'm going to go get some, like, Korean food. Man, I was thinking about getting some Carl's Jr. and filming, filming this in the parking lot of Carl's Jr., but I was like, man, I don't really want Carl's Jr. I just had McDonald's, like, yesterday. And if you guys aren't using the mobile rewards app for McDonald's, I highly recommend it because you get like free food and you get a lot of good deals. Yesterday I got a deal for like uh, a free Big Mac with the purchase of anything $1 or more. So I basically just got a free Big Mac. I bought like a 20 piece nugget and then I got a free Big Mac. So yeah, overall it was a pretty good deal. Okay, so just one layer of, oh, we got some loose parts here. This is actually cracked. That's probably cracked from shipping. And let's see, what do we have here? Yeah, it looks like Eternal Sharp and Whole Flat from Cyber Pegasus. Sorry for all the heavy breathing, guys. I'm actually bending down because I'm just using some makeshift boxes here. And I'm just putting it on here. Okay. Oh man, take a look. Like all the Beyblades just fell out. So, okay, here we go. I tried to go through everything, but I want to make it as quick as possible just because. You know, I actually opened this upside down too, that's why. Let's take all this out. Sorry, your guys' ears are gonna get destroyed. Yeah, this this box is no longer good to keep anymore, but whatever. Okay, so that's everything. And look at that. They had a little sticker of Ray Unicorno. They must have been a fan of Ray Unicorno. Let's put that in the back. And already see you guys probably see like a lot of good stuff in there already. Look at that. Some of this, some of that. Earth Eagle. I'm assuming these are all Takara Tomi, like legit. Look, you see the code right there, A1. Nice. Let's take a look. There's another code, so A4. I don't even know if they have a mid fake of the blue version, but man, these all look legit. Look at the condition of this, of this Libra wheel. So good. This is the last revision, I think. So it has all these gaps filled in, these two gaps up here, the squares, the the top and the bottom. So this is like the heaviest version of Libra, I believe. It was released in a three pack. Nice. This is really good for, I think, competitive, limited, I, I believe. Uh, all right, let's go through, let's go through all the stuff that's on the floor right now. And then I'll put it on the left side. So we have, this is Leviathan, I believe, pre-hybrid wheel. I was going to order this brand new, but then I saw it in the slot already. So I was like, oh, you know what? Forget it. I'll just I'll just get, keep it here. So I was on a uh, the road to collecting all the pre-hybrid wheels, and I'm almost done. And here we go. We have a thermal. Thermal metal wheel. I don't see a code, but I'm pretty sure it's real. You know, if, if these earth wheels are, are real, then, you know, everything else is actually got to be real so I'm not doubting anything at this point I'm just gonna assume everything's real so Ray there we go we got a code up there on the top A1 this is I believe the Stardust version of Galaxy and it's in pretty good condition yeah pretty good condition if you look at it just for like from the top you can't even tell that it's used like probably just barely Especially not from the bottom. And there we have a code for A3. 
What do we have next? We have dark. I did need a dark wheel for my dark bowl. It's really, really dull. And I'm trying to find... I'm actually trying to find a rock wheel for... Um, trying to find a rock wheel for my rock Aries too. Got a burn wheel. Rock Aries. Storm. I have rock. I'm just going to pull out the ones that are, are different. I'm not going to pull out like five different rock fusion wheels. So the video won't get too stale. Here we have a lightning. Uh, poison. I don't know which one this came in. It's like a different color. It's like... It's like gun metal. Is this one fake? Is this a mid fake? There's no way, right? There's a code in there. A4. I don't know what the combo for this is. I'm gonna have to look that up. Um, then we have Gravity Destroyer. Really excited for this one too because the only Gravity Destroyer that I have is the one that comes in the Super Vortex Battle Set. That comes with Ray, Ray Striker. And here we have a, I think this is Hasbro, Cyber Pegasus. And we have that whole flat from earlier, like I said. We have Killer, also known as Evil. Cool. Aquario. I think this is 105 flat. This is Lee Mays. It's not the original pre-hybrid version. And I forgot what this one is called, but I believe it was from the video game, right? From... Counter Leon or something like that. Obviously, we have the Libra wheel already. Capricorn, pre-hybrid wheel. Um, this one's always really cheap anywhere I go. And it's probably not too popular. But I like it just because uh, I don't know, it has like really good upper attacks and smash attacks. But here we have El Scopio, pre-hybrid wheel. I already have one of these. Many of these, I'm probably just going to find the stock combos and then just list them up. Oh, I might use this one for my Rock Aries. It's pretty shiny. Looks in really good condition. Another Poison Wheel, this time in original color. Show you guys the two, just so you guys can see the difference. Then here we have Leon. Oh, nice. This one has the stickers. I might use this one and replace it from my Leon. Pre hybrid Leon. We have another Pegasus one. It's in pretty good condition, too. And we have Rubber Flat. Decent condition. I mean, it's, it's worn down, but it's, I've seen like a lot worse. Here we go with the original Galaxy Wheel with. Um, some custom stickers. It's actually in really good condition too. And whoever owned this lot just really didn't use them, huh? A couple performance tips. Looks like a whole flat. Pisces. Man, if we have a pre-hybrid Pisces from the random booster, that's going to be so sick. We have Eternal Sharp for Libra. We have Virgo. Looks like a different version of Virgo and Pegasus. Some Storm Pegasus. Uh, we got the Pisces D145 BS. This is not the one that is random booster, unfortunately. But, oh well, I actually don't have this one in my collection yet. So, that's actually going to be pretty cool. Just an original Earth Wheel. Looks like it's in decent condition. Flame. Might as well show it off since I picked it up, right? Storm. Here we have another pre-hybrid wheel. This is Bull. And no stickers and the paint's already pretty chipped off. I don't know if I'm going to use that one. Rock. This one's super oxidized. I don't know if you can tell. Man, this one's, this one's definitely seen better days. This flame wheel is super shiny. That's really cool. Nice. Um... Here we have the Wolf pre-hybrid wheel. I already have one ready too. And Jimmyos, I might actually use this one. Looks like it has a little bit more stickers, but they're not sticky anymore and they're popping up. I don't really like that. 
Cool. We got some face bolts, rock or so. So maybe we have the rock or so in here. Storm. Storm Capricorn. Hopefully we have the Storm Capricorn in here. We, it looks like uh, this is rubber sharp. Maybe it looks like it could have been rubber sharp, but it's super worn down. Jagged ball or jog ball. There we just have a regular ball. And then um, poison serpents. All right, let's see. Let's see what else we have in here. Anything special? If there's anything special in here, I'll let you guys know. Storm, flame, more flame. Here we have a ray fusion wheel, the recolor with some custom stickers on it. That's pretty cool. <laughs> I might just keep it like this, to be honest. And this does have a code, so I'm assuming this is real. And the molding actually looks pretty good, too. So there's, like, not any extra metal hanging off anywhere or anything like that. No messy details, so really cool. Another pre-hybrid reel. This is, I think, Libra, I believe. Uh, I don't know if this is the, like, a random booster version or a different version. I already have one, though. Dark. Rock. And here we have another ray. This one is green. So that's really cool. And it does have a code as well. It looks like it's authentic. No extra metal anywhere. Man, all these are in pretty good condition. And here we just have like a bunch of extra parts here. We have like some bright rubber flats. Seen better days, definitely. I could probably totally put this on my Hasbro Samurai Pegasus because it's actually missing the performance tip. Um, we got some more Eternal Sharps. Another Eternal Sharp. That's it for all the wheels. Um, maybe I'll just point out some other stuff. This looks like uh, a pretty good condition. Uh, what is this? Rubber Semi Flat from Ray Gill. I'll just take out some of the more important parts. Looks like rubber flat maybe on one of these special edition Pegasus. Special edition Pegasus. I don't think I have a special edition Pegasus. I don't know what that one goes on actually. Look at this. Pretty cool custom sticker of Capricorn. It's like shiny. That's cool. And fun fact, Capricorn was actually one of my first Beyblades back in the day with my little brother. I didn't really like, like uh, the Metal Fight Beyblades. Oh man, this one just got destroyed. I didn't really like Metal Fight Beyblade back in the day because uh, just because I didn't like Jenga's voice, I'm not gonna lie. And Kenta, their voices were kind of annoying. I'm not gonna lie. Here we go, we have the Leviathan face bolt. Really nice. Cyber Pegasus face bolt. Um, a Unicorno face bolt. Got the Leon face bolt. There we go. Aquila face bolt. Let me know in the comments down below. What do you guys like to call this? Do you guys like to call it Eagle or Aquila? I'm, I think I'm going to start calling it Aquila from now on. Uh, this looks like it could be Lightning L Drago's face bolt, but they have like a custom sticker on there. Oh, yeah, and it says L with the dragon face right there. So definitely like a custom dragon sticker. So there we have Aquario for the Lee Mays Aquario. Whole Sharp. Nicorno. Is there anything special? I think this one goes on. Earth Eagle. I don't think there's anything too special here anymore. Um, got that. There we go. We got a El Drago face bolt there. Oh, look. Another holographic. Uh, Serpent face bolt, Gemios, Galaxy Pegasus. We're just basically looking at face bolts now. Any more? Some more holographic ones. Galaxy Pegasus. Pretty cool. Some more holographic ones, or like custom ones at the very least. I don't know what 
these are, I'm pretty sure one of them is Pisces. Here we go, we have like a wide flat, it seems. I think this one goes on um, Quetzalcoatl. Here we have Quake or whatever it's called for Storm Capricorn. Another Galaxy Pegasus. Wolf. Here like this. This is one. Leo for the, the green Leo wheel. Bull. But I don't see horn 145 in here. But I do see the semi-flat that goes with dark bull. So that's unfortunate. There's no horn 145 in here. Oh, maybe it might be in this one. Oh, I, I totally forgot. There's there's another. I forgot about that blue. I forgot about that blue bag over there. There's still more. My back actually hurts so much right now, guys. Just bending down right now. I'm trying to get through this video pretty quick. Is there anything else in here? That's like special. I'm just trying to look real quick. What's this? I don't know what this is. Is this Bixis? It might be, huh? I've never had a Bixis before, so. Oh, look, another holographic one. That is so cool. Oh, that's Unicorn. Oh, that's really cool. Phoenix. Cool. Okay. All right, and then we'll take a look at this. Let's see what's in here. Oh, look, there, there it is, Horn 145, cool. Legit, that's awesome. Oh, I just had to crack my back real quick. what's in here I'm just gonna start grabbing stuff out <laughs> look at this and we have a uh, rock giraffe and this looks like the cap for the LR bay launcher for gravity Perseus looks like poison or I mean uh, serpent look at this this looks so nice it's like glossy diamond it has like sparkles inside of the clear wheel I think Wait, oh, actually, those are stickers. There's stickers underneath, and then when you look at it on the top, it, like, glitters. That's really cool. Whoever did, whoever did that, that's actually pretty sick. I might, do, <laughs> I might do that to, like, other clear wheels from now on. That's really, really cool. And looks like this is the Phoenix Fusion Wheel, or clear wheel. Uh, El Scopio. Orso, from Rock Orso. And here we have, it's kind of stuck on here pretty good, not going to lie. Here we go. It's from Pegasus 2, looks like Galaxy Pegasus. Oh man, it's like stuck. Oh no, it's not stuck, you just got to put this in, I totally forgot. Oh, it works. Yeah, let's go. Let's go, boys. It works. It retracts really good, too. Nice. Let's try it on right spin. Yes. It works. So I've never actually had this, like, extra piece right here before. I don't really know what it is, but... Uh, you know, whatever. I see, like, the Geoverse use it and stuff, so... Mm -hmm. Whatever. That's my first time owning a Gravity Perseus um, launcher. So this looks like Flame Aquila from Random Booster. I already have one of those. I'm gonna from uh, the Switch 145. Looks like DF 145. Uh, this looks like it goes on. I don't remember. I don't remember which one this one goes on. I think Quetzalcoatl. Free hybrid Quetzalcoatl. Um, definitely probably one that goes on Ray Unicorno. Defense 125, I believe. T125, I think. Um, Claw 145, it goes on Flame Sagittario. Another Aquila. 
and um, just the classic, I think, 145. DF-145. This one probably goes on Pisces. Serpent. Uh, just a assembly tool. We have, looks like, 80, either 85 or 90. I can never tell the difference between the heights on these things. Either 85 or 90. Uh, Storm Pegasus. Fusion wheel. Clear wheel. 145. I'm going to just look through anything that's particularly unique in here so flame bixis so i saw online that it did have the stock combo for flame bixis it'll be my first time owning flame bixis aquila this is oh this one's super messed up look at that i don't know if it's going to be usable or not we'll see um i forgot what this is called this is for i thought hmm is this this is for Sagittarius, right? Oh, nice! Look at this custom stickers for Capricorn, I believe. That's cool. There you go, Unicorno. El Drago, the black version, and Gravity Destroyers Spin Track. Uh, I think another Capricorn. Some stickers. Gemios. I think this is bull. I believe this is one of the heaviest. Um, oh, look at these custom stickers. Nice. I believe bull is one of the heaviest clear wheels. And then here we have. I forgot what this piece goes on. Extra pieces right here. Um, looks like Virgo. I don't know what this is. I think it's supposed to be switch 145 as well, but it's missing the switch part. Uh, Bixis. Nice. D125 for Unicorno. Ray Gill. Horn 145. This is the updated mold. So if you guys don't know, the non updated one does not have these things filled in. So, Horn 145, nice. Anything else? Either 85 or 90. I don't remember which one this goes on. So, let me check if there's anything else that's cool in here. Like, clear wheel for, translucent clear wheel for Pegasus, it seems. Another Capricorn, just a regular Capricorn this time. Big sis, I think. It's, no, this is Libra, right? That's Libra. Another defense. Uh, Leon. I don't know if this is like just regular Rock Leon or pre hybrid or anything like that. No, pre hybrid don't have wheels. Okay, cool. So we have a Switch 145, but it's like. Like this, <laughs> different color. Gravity ball for Virgo, I believe. And we have another Kono Gravity Destroyer. Just grab all these out. Rock Giraffe. It's supposed to be rubber, right? Let's check all these out. What is this going on? I don't I don't remember what this is. Tools, wing 105, Galaxy Pegasus, Earth Aquila, and yeah, that's basically it, guys. So yeah, here's the Vulcan Harusius one more time, brand new, mint. It's not going to be mint for long, though. I'm going to be using this for battle, I'm not going to lie. I don't want to spend like another 40 bucks just to get a used one <laughs> to play. <laughs> I'm just going to use this one straight up, I'm not going to lie. But let's see if we can build the um, Bixis real quick because um, I've never had a Bixis before and I actually really want a Bixis. 
So let's use that really shiny flame wheel that was here. I don't think it's a mid fake. So I have the Bixis clear wheel, flame. 230 so 230 it's gonna be a little too hard to find a face bolt right now Bixis what color is the, his Bixis face bolt I think it's the same color as this right maybe I can speed up the process by elimination here's the performance tip for it though Looks on quite nice. Let's try to find the well, trying to find the color that fits with this. Kind of hard to find right now. Probably just gonna have to find it later. I'll probably just put like a random face bolt on it. Wait, is this is this Bixis? Cause it's a compass, right? I don't know if Bixis is supposed to be like um, translucent like that. So there we go, Flame Bixis. I've always wanted a Flame Bixis. Looks really cool. All right guys, so we're gonna end off the video right here. If you guys like the video, go ahead and press that like button. And um, you know, just subscribe, turn on the notification bell so you guys won't miss any more unboxings like these. And I can't wait to go home and just like sort out all these parts and put them all together. Like, I mean, come on, look at these. All authentic Takara Tomy. This is so sick. So sick. Right? Man. Alright guys, one last shot. It's all the trash over there. Of everything here. Probably gonna use this for the thumbnail. Let me actually, let me actually get a good, let me actually get a good view of this. Probably, this is probably gonna be the thumbnail right here. Yep, probably just screenshot that real quick. Actually, I might put this, I might put this right here. All right, that's most likely gonna be the thumbnail. All right, guys. So if you guys enjoy this, press the like button. Alright, peace out guys, have a good day.